I'm Sean Zettler. I'm a Senior Environment Advisor for uh, BC Works. And I've been working uh, for the, uh, the company for about uh, 21, 22 years now and working in the environment on air quality, permitting and special projects. Uh, we're, we're informing the, uh, the, the public about the, uh, the restart of the uh, Coke Health Signer uh, because the emissions from the power scrubber are visible. Uh, from time to time, they may appear bluish or grayish. My name's Brent Volk. I'm the Director of Operations for Reduction and Casting at PC Works. We've been restarting the plant and the number of pots that are operating has been increasing steadily over the past year and our demand in calcine coke has been increasing as well. Uh, now we're at a stage where uh, our supply of calcine coke can't be fully delivered by external sources and we have to begin uh, producing calcine coke internally. Uh, without the coke calciner we won't be able to sustain the ramp up of pots uh, to full production. The uh, emissions from the uh, coke calcine and the power scrubber are not new. Uh, the uh, Cal Signer has been in operation in Kitimat uh, for uh, many, many years. And uh, the Cal Signer has been uh, shut down for the past uh, couple of years. And we're just in the process of restarting it and resuming normal emissions uh, from the process in the coming days. Uh, we have a very detailed uh, SO2 and volume effects monitoring program that uh, monitors the effects of uh, sulfur dioxide on the environment and human health. Uh, the effects of uh, sulfur dioxide in the environment include potential risks to acidification on lakes as well as soils and uh, plant ecosystems. And then for human health, we have a uh, human health indicator, which is the BC SO2 air quality objective that uh, we must comply with at the air monitoring stations in Kitimat, the residential stations and also the station in the service centre. The uh, air quality measurements have been below the air quality objective to date. Uh, since we adopted the Human Health KPI in 2017. And we, we engage uh, with the Minister of Environment and First Nations, uh, the community, especially the Community Airshed Group on the uh, emissions from the smelter and especially on the sulfur dioxide and the uh, monitoring of the air quality in Kitimat. Uh, we pour it out as well as we do extensive consultations on the SO2 and Volume Monitoring Program for both the uh, designs of the program and then also for the annual reporting of the results.